Major cause of depression amongst the Ummah is because they've moved away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah is making them forget their own selves. Own selves. Because their identity, the, the holistic nature of what it means to be a human being for a Muslim is via the worship of Allah. Try it, taste it, taste it. Taste Trust me. Try it, taste it, taste it, taste it. And you come to the point that if the whole world were to argue against Islam, you still believe. Still believe. Because once you've tasted paradise. You know it's true. Now you may think, who am I? I've come to this masjid. I spoke to some girls the other day. I've got a girlfriend. I drink some alcohol. I do this and I do that. I'm not good. I lie to my parents. I pretend to pray. I'm a fake Muslim. I'm a big sinner. I do major sins. Major sins. Wallahi by Allah, this attitude is an attitude from shaitan. Allah always allows always U-turns. Allows U-turns. Always allows U-turns. Don't despair of the mercy of Allah, Allah says in the Quran. Ya ibadi, oh my believing servants, do not despair of my mercy. For Allah forgives all sins. All sins. Even shirk. If you don't die on shirk, obviously. Because the Sahaba were shirk, they became Muslim, they were forgiven. If you did previous shirk and you do repentance, Allah forgives. The only sin he doesn't forgive you die upon shirk, die upon shirk. or you didn't repent from shirk. From, shirk. from shirk. So Allah is saying, all those sins you're thinking about, Allah's rahmah and forgiveness overcomes this. this. Don't pray into the hands of shaitan that you won't go to the masjid and you won't start praying because you go, all of these, all bad, of deeds. these bad deeds. Don't be like that. This is not from Allah. Allah, your Lord is a merciful Lord. Your Lord is Al Wudud. You know what Al Wudud means? This is his name. It's an intrinsic part of his being, which means the excessively loving. The excessively loving. It's an excessive form of love. The Prophet said that Allah loves you more than a mother loves her child. You find me a greater love in the dunya. The greatest love is the, is the mother's love, but Allah loves you more. To indicate the greatness of His love, all He wants you to do is repent. That is it. Tawbah. Tawbah. To return. Linguistically means to return. To return. Just to return to Him. That's all He's saying. That's all He is saying. And He's saying, I forgive. Just repent. Raise your hands tonight and say, Ya Allah, I have done these sins. You know me better than I know myself. I've done sins that I don't even know of and you know. But forgive me, I'm taking the first step. Fajr. Dhuhr. Dhuhr. Asr. Asr. And continuing. And you hit the floor, bounce back. Bounce back. No one's going to be perfect. No one's going to stay the same. Iman fluctuates. But keep with your prayers. That is the key to the success. قَدْ أَفْلَهَ mu'minun. Indeed, successful are the believers. So don't despair, ikhwan. No matter, even an hour ago you did the sin. Even two minutes ago you did the sin. Don't be in that state of despair. Because Allah says in the Quran elsewhere, only, only, only the disbelievers despair of His mercy. Of his mercy. Remember, the doors of repentance are open until the time of death. The door of repentance are open until the time of death.